What's going on people? It's your bro, your host Quest here, and I'm bringing you guys another World War 2 gameplay commentary. And before starting this gameplay commentary, I'd like to say if you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and smash that like button because the support will be really appreciated. And I've been searching on YouTube lately and I haven't seen this class setup yet. And basically what I'm gonna talk about today is the best class setup in World War 2 right now. So you guys will see it on the screen right now. It's an LMG class, and the class is the MG-15 with grip, rapid fire, and quid draw. And um, my division is the is the infantry, and with the basic training, it's going to be hustle. Now, you guys can use anything you want as secondary or anything you want as lethal or non-lethal, whatever you guys want to use. That's not really important, but this is the main thing that you have to do. And the reason why I'm using the first one, the first division, is because that... When you get to, when you get to the max level of the first division at the end at level five I think so, you unlock stalker and in this game this is the only stock that you can have. So you guys do realize that stalker helps you to aim down the side quicker and to fucking flick on enemies and freaking beast on them. And anyways, guys, I'm gonna talk about how like how what do I think about this game? Seriously, like the game has been out for like two months now. And I think this game is kind of promising. It's much better than Black Ops 3, than Infinity Warfare. I didn't play too much Infinity Warfare, but I didn't really like Infinity Warfare just the fact that it was jumping and stuff, you know. I didn't really like the game, and I didn't think the game was, um, you know, a good game at all. But World War 2 is actually not, it's a decent game. Like, it's not better than Black Ops 2 and neither Modern Warfare 3. Because, um, to point this, this, uh, to point this out, Modern Warfare 3 was the best Call of Duty ever. Like, it beat, it beat it Black Ops 2, and it was just awesome. So, like I had so much fun in Modern Warfare 3 but um World War 2 wasn't that bad I mean I've been playing World War 2 for like two months now and I think World War 2 is a pretty good game I'm really sorry for my inactivity on my channel like I've been inactive just because I didn't want to make videos I thought that it was too long to make videos commentary you know I was kind of lazy and I didn't really want to freaking make videos but anyways i'm back now i'm gonna I'm doing i'm gonna be doing much much more videos and much more commentary gameplays and um hopefully you guys will enjoy this gameplay in the background i mean it's not the best of the best i'm just trying to get my vicious medal my high score streak right now i think it's 19 i went in the streak at 19 and then i died i still have the gameplay but i have half the gameplay because um I wasn't recording as I was playing and I thought I was I was on a 15 gun streak. I thought that I would probably get the new clear so I started recording when I was at like 10 or I think 11 gun streak or some kind of shit like that but I don't remember it was with the same gun the MG15 and I was just beasting on the same map again. So anyways guys if you guys want to see that gameplay just comment down below. Let's read into the main subject. I got a little bit off the subject right here. Anyways, guys, the MJ-15 has a nice long range, close range, and mid range gunfight. Like I can pretty be pretty much. That's what I'm telling you guys to use grip, because um, at long range gunfight you can't really use if you if you don't use grip, you have rapid fire on. Like you can't really pick up long range gunfight because the recoil is gonna be too much for you to control it. So that's why I recommend grip, just because yeah, you can pick up long range gunfight and mid range gunfight. And this is pretty much it's pretty much nice gun. It, it hits right. I mean, there's a lot of nice guns in World War 2 right now, especially the DLCs. I recommend you guys using the DLCs. I haven't been getting the DLCs and I didn't pay for the DLCs. I thought it was pretty much too much for the new Call of Duty. I mean, I don't really pay for the DLCs. Most of the Call of Duty, I never really paid for the DLCs, so I don't really care about the DLCs and the DLC map and stuff. But you'll see. I'll probably, I'll probably buy them because, um, I don't know, I'm not sure if I'm gonna buy them or not. I don't know if it's worth it, but I saw a few YouTubers playing with the DLC guns and I think that DLC guns are really overpowered in this game. Like, I've seen people picking me up with DLC guns and I'm like, what the fuck? Like, what the fuck just happened? Anyways, that's why, so this is not, this is not a DLC gun, the MJ-15. This is one of the best guns in World War II right now without the DLCs. And, um, yeah, so this is what I have to talk about. Like, the LMGs in, in this game are just overpowered as fuck. The LMGs, I love playing with the LMGs. I mean, it's pretty much slow, but, like, I love, like, you know, I love the close range and long range gunfight because with the SMGs, I'm sorry guys, with the SMGs, you can't really pick up a long range gunfight. You really have to be lucky if you want to pick up a long range gunfight. And I don't know what to say, like, the LMGs are just perfect in this game. And I really enjoy playing this game right now. I'm having too much fun. And if you guys want to play with me, feel free to add me up. I, um, I'm going to leave some few friends that's inactive on my um, account on what you give me quest. So feel free to add me up and feel free to come play with me. I need a, I basically need a team to get the vicious medal because 
still haven't get the the medal so like it's pretty sad for me and it's pretty sad for me because for a Call of Duty player like me always getting bow wrapped and always getting green clears and stuff and coming to a new game and not getting the fish it's pretty much a big thing for me so if you guys are good if you guys have some tips for me actually that I can actually use to get the vicious medal let me know in the comment section down below and that's all for today guys hopefully you guys will enjoy the gameplay if you did don't forget to drop that subscribe button and let's smash that like button to support it does help my channel a bit because my channel is not really glowing like I have 3k sub right now and it's not really going anywhere because I stopped uploading and yeah that's it for today guys hopefully you guys have enjoyed it and peace out